Today's episode of Hell's Kitchen is brought to you by Haste, the app in free beta that will help you stabilize your ping if it's up and down all the time. See what I see what I did there, because Zach, okay, okay, forget it. The software itself is built from the ground up and it's optimized for League of Legends and Overwatch servers specifically, so give it a try and also send me some more bread, please. This is gonna get messy. This Vanguard rework, well, I actually like it, to be honest. I'm not gonna rant on this. It's unpredictable, it's crazy, it's all up in your fucking face. Everything Zack should be. Now, as you know, I never read the patch notes. Candy Mundy knows everything. Candy Mundy's a golden god with fantastic hair and a great beard and a great voice and is a great animator. Anyway, uh, first game I played as Zack. He threw me all over the fucking place like ragdoll physics on crack. I'm not used to this shit, man. First thing I see from new Zack is he's fucking attached to everything and everything. Everyone like glue, get this shit off of me, please. I'm on a nervous breakdown. Now, people often ask me, Clearly, Mundy, who's your favorite champion? And I always say the same thing Zezima, who's a fucking hero. Nah, okay, I like big tanks and junglers, and junglers and big tanks. And what better combination of these two fucking categories than this huge blob of goo from those alien egg things that don't have children, but people thought they did? When you have over 6k health and can literally fly into enemies from obscene distances away, totally unaware, how can you not love this? green, pink, yellow, blue, brown piece of shit. Oh wait, yeah, uh, I guess it is actually kind of annoying if it's on the enemy team. His new ult is more disgusting and disorienting than trying to play League upside down, under fucking water, on fire in space, in 240p. Try to think of Zack as your go-to guy for general pain in the arsery. If you like to counter jungle and tilt your enemy and disrupt the flow of lanes and shit, and just be an inflatable nuisance, then Zack is the guy for you! Provided you don't just first time him in ranked and feed and come crashing down on your team like a lead fucking zeppelin. You like that pun? Anytime Riot rework a champion these days, they always make them require more skill so they're less talentless cheese like back in the day when LeBlanc had a silence or when Cat was Cat. Now, not only is Zack a useful body blocker in team fights, but he's also a useful body blocker in team fights. <laughs> because he literally gets bigger with health, which is fucking stupid. So yes, if you have one HP, that means you're literally like fucking Ant-Man and you can sneak up on the enemies and uh, die in one hit. Because you're not a fucking assassin, you're a tank. So what do we build? Keeping in spirit with Zack, we're gonna start out with this bucket of green goo, because uh, uh, actually, no, fuck this. You know what? I'm not even gonna try and bullshit you here. We all know that the only fucking build for Zack is five warmogs and boots of boots. Even if you're fucking jungling, you don't need a machete, it's dangerous, it could chop you in half, you're so squishy. Now get out there and cause some fucking chaos on the elo ladder and piss everyone else off in your team. Well I don't know why I came here tonight, I got a feeling that something ain't right. I'm so scared in case I fall off my chair, and I'm wondering how I get down the stairs. Clowns to the left of me, jokers to the right, here I am, stuck in the middle.